God is with us in our waiting. Our Daily Bread Today's encouragement from the Our Daily Bread devotional was written by David Roper. Waiting for the fish to bite, or waiting for wind to fly a kite, or waiting around for Friday night, everyone is just waiting. Or so Dr. Seuss, author of many children's books, says. So much of life is about waiting, but God is never in a hurry, or so it seems. God has his hour and delay, suggests an old reliable saying. Thus we wait. Waiting is hard. We twiddle our thumbs, shuffle our feet, stifle our yawns, heave long sighs, and fret inwardly in frustration. Why must I live with this awkward person, this tedious job, this embarrassing behavior, this health issue that will not go away? Why doesn't God come through? God's answer? Wait a while and see what I will do. Waiting is one of life's best teachers, for in it we learn the virtue of, well, waiting. Waiting while God works in us and for us. It's in waiting that we develop endurance, the ability to trust God's love and goodness, even when things aren't going our way. But waiting is not dreary, teeth-clenched resignation. As Psalm 70 verse 4 says, we can rejoice and be glad in Him while we wait. We wait in hope, knowing that God will deliver us in due time, in this world or in the next. God is never in a hurry, but He's always on time. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is Psalm 70. Hasten, O God, to save me. Come quickly, Lord, to help me. May those who want to take my life be put to shame and confusion. May all who desire my ruin be turned back in disgrace. May those who say to me, Aha! Aha! turn back because of their shame. But may all who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. May those who long for your saving help always say, The Lord is great. But as for me, I am poor and needy. Come quickly to me, O God. You are my help and my deliverer. Lord, do not delay. Psalm 70 is today's scripture reading. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for your loving presence. Help us to make the most of our waiting through trust in and service for you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.